Good morning, students. Hello, this is Meenal Ma'am. Do you remember yesterday we have started with a literature book? Yes, I am here again to take you a little ahead of what we have done yesterday. Tell me which poem we have started with. Yes, that's right, Little Wind. Very good children. You are paying attention to our lectures. Well done. Okay. So today I am here to take you a little ahead of it. Okay. But before moving ahead, let's do a small recap. Yes. Okay. So videos wherein there were two teachers who were feeling so hot. So what they did? They turned on the fan and they enjoyed and they felt Cool and comfortable with the cool breeze which came from fan. Then the on, in the other video we have seen strong wind. How it swayed all the trees. Yes, we also spoke that the wind can be gentle and also it can be violent by nature. Yes, I hope that you remember everything. Okay. So as I have told you yesterday about the two types of wind, it can be gentle as well as it can be violent, it can destroy anything, it can uproot the trees, it can destroy large buildings. Yes, storm hurricanes come because of these strong winds. So shall we look at it through videos? Yes, I know you all like videos too much. So let's go and enjoy this. Not enjoy. Let's observe how wind takes place. So first, I'll play a gentle breeze video. Okay?
many words to describe this video. I'm sure you might have also got stunned looking at this, right? This is a violent phase of wind. And kids, this we have faced it, right? In our face, lot of problems because of the storm named as Nisarga. Yes, you have seen here that the wind when it gets a very harsh, uh, harsh by nature, it can destroy big buildings. It can uproot large trees. It can destroy a whole city as well. Okay? So kids, little wind can become a gentle as well as violent by nature. Okay children? So here, as we have seen two videos, one of the wind, cool gentle breeze and the other of this violent strong harsh wind. Yes kids, I would request you that if you get time, sit with your parents and search how a storm Nisarg destroyed many places. Okay? You are going to watch that video children, okay? And we will discuss, I am going to ask you the questions on upcoming Friday online discussion. Okay? So kids, let's move on to our next slide. Okay children, coming back to our next slide. Okay, so before I start with my phone, I would like you to describe the picture what you can see here. Yes? Okay, I'll help you out. Okay children, so tell me what is this? Correct, this is sun. Yes, we get sunshine from sun. Okay. What are these? Clouds. Very good kids. Next, look at this. What is it? Yes, this is a girl. Pretty girl. Okay. And what is this? They are mountains. We can also call them as hilltop. Okay? Very good. And can you see here in this picture that the girl is wearing a beautiful pretty dress and her hair are open and what she is enjoying? She is enjoying cool breeze. Yay! So this is what is there in this picture. And one more thing we left is, what is this? Yes, grass. Very good. So, this is a plain area. Okay, a flat surface, a plain area. Or we can call it as a ground. Okay, so kids, very good. As you have described full page. Now, shall we start with reading a poem? Yes. Okay. So this time you are going to repeat after me. Okay. With actions. Yes. Let's start. Little wind. Blow on the hill top. Okay? So children, here is a boat. Okay? And 
now we will do line by line reading. Okay? And I will make you understand what every word means. Okay? So see, as we have read there, little wind blow on the hilltop. Blow on the hilltop. Okay children? So now, what does hilltop mean? Hilltop. Very good. Hilltop is also called as mountains. You all know this. And blow means you know blowing of wind. Okay? So little wind blow on the hilltop. Okay? Yes, you all know hilltops are on heights. So wind also blow there on the hilltop. Okay? Next line says little wind blow down the plain. Blow down the plain. Okay, children? Now, hear this plain word. When you heard this plain word, I know you might have thought of an aeroplane, right? But children, that plain spelling is P-L-A-N-E. And can you see here? What does this spelling say? What does this spelling say? P-L-A-I-N. Okay, so this plain word means a flat surface, a ground level. Okay, that is plain means what? You can call it as ground also. Okay, so little wind blow down the plain. Means the little wind also blow down the plain area. Okay, where you play cricket, football, any kind of outdoor games. Okay, next. Little wind Blow up the sunshine. Okay children. Now blow up the sunshine. You all know the meaning of blow? Why we have written here up children? Where do you see the sun? Up or down? Obviously up. Very good. So sunshine will come from upwards. Right? So little wind blow up the sunshine. You all know the shine of sun. Yes, sunshine. Okay. Next line says, little wind blow off the rain. Okay. Now, blow off the rain. Now, kids, as this is monsoon going on, we are enjoying drizzling of rain, right? Rain drops. Wow. So, kids, little wind also blows off the rain. Okay. So understood this words? Shall we do a small recap again? Yes. Blow on the hilltop which says hilltop mountains. Blow down the plain. It says it blow down the plain area also. Surface area also. Ground level also. Blow down the sunshine. I'm sorry. Blow up the sunshine. Yes. From where sun gives a shine, there also wind blows. Then blow off the rain. Yes, when rain comes, it also brings wind along with it. Okay? Understood kids? So which are the new words which we have learned here? The new words are hilltop, plain, sunshine and rain. Okay? Repeat after me. Hilltop, plain, sunshine and rain. Okay? You would like to see the pictures of these all new words? Yes. I will show you. Come to kids as you wanted to see the picture. And here are few pictures. Okay. So see kids. What is this? Hilltop. Okay? Hilltop. And see, you can see two people are standing here and enjoying the cool breeze. Right? So this is hilltop. You want to see next picture? Yes. See? Plain. Okay? This is a kind of a ground which can be also called as plain. Okay? A little bit blows down the Plain as well. Next, what is this picture, children? Good work. This is sun, and these 
are the sun rays and sun is giving us sunshine. Good children. Next. Wow. Raindrops. Wow. See? Little wind also blow off the rain. Okay? I know many of you like to get wet in the rain. Right? But kids, stay home. Okay? Don't get wet in the rain. Kids. Okay? So now, so here I am going to end now. But before ending my session, I would like to do a small recap. Yes? So in this session, we have seen two types of wind. Okay? One is very gentle breeze and the other is strong, harsh, boiling wind. Right? We have seen two videos on it. And then later on, we read this rhyme doing actions. Okay? I have sent you the picture of this rhyme. Right? I hope you read it again with the actions. Yes? Okay kids. Now I will end my session here. Tomorrow's session we will study the details of this rhyme. Okay? So, till now. Bye-bye.